Imagine taking a gardening class from the best horticultural expert in the world. Well, you could learn to grow everything and anything. Well, my friends, it's simpler than you might think. Observe nature. Um, so that's, that's, you know, spending time in your garden, watching what's going on. You guessed it. The best gardening instructor in the world is Mother Nature herself. And there's a growing movement out there called permaculture that celebrates this concept. Just maybe try to go to that it's end. recommended uh, when you're making a permaculture design to spend a full year observing your garden and uh, really get to know it. And Jeff Johnson practices permaculture in his own yard in Fernwood and loves to teach people how they too can borrow the wisdom of nature to create an edible and sustainable garden. This is about to erupt with potatoes because I'm composting my leaves and growing potatoes at the same time. <laughs> Permaculture is a design science that's rooted in the observation of the natural world. And essentially we look at natural ecosystems to see what it is that makes them so resilient and abundant and long-lived. And we try to apply those principles to the way that we design our own human habitats. This is one of two different uh, rain harvesting systems. This approach yeah, to gardening yeah, considers sense, things sure. like yeah. so, collecting yeah, rainwater kind of to irrigate, composting, and creating little you know, ecosystems in your yard so things grow in harmony. Like nettles, comfrey, and yarrow. And those plants do different things, um, like accumulating nutrients for soil fertility, um, uh, providing composting materials. Uh, they also bring in beneficial insects to act as predators for pests and for pollinators. Creating a permaculture garden may be a bit of work, but it does pay off. Once you have a good design and it's implemented, um, you know, these systems are, are self-regulating. Um, they, they take care of themselves. So, uh, you know, that's, that's the, the magic of working with nature um, is, is that it actually saves us a huge amount of work. You know, we're causing ourselves a lot of trouble by working against nature. Jeff and Ian teach folks how they can shape their own permaculture-friendly garden. And for them, it's much more than just horticulture. It's a way of thinking. Gardening is already actually the number one recreational activity in Canada. So we really just need to make a shift into real functional, uh, integrated ecological gardening. If you want to learn from Mother Nature, you have to spend time in her classroom. Now this is a homework assignment I can get excited about. From Fernwood, I'm Karen Algizma, your Lifestyle Specialist.